Hello everyone, Tom was here back at it with another, we're actually going to do something a little bit different um, than, uh, we're going to be in the weird and wild world of uh, trading cards. You know, I used to have a bunch of trading cards growing up, um, collected a bunch, we used to play off the wall with them, that's before we knew about cards that could be graded and cards that were worth money. I'm sure at some point I bounced a Ken Griffey Jr. rookie card off a wall in a game and certain other silly things that I did with those cards and never held on to them and kept them. But for those who are unfamiliar, uh, the world of cards currently, uh, namely basketball, baseball, football, the big three sports, um, hockey to a lesser extent, but the three major sports is insane right now. Um, they are sold out everywhere. People are buying them. They're selling them for unbelievable amount of money, especially basketball cards. People are Zion hunting. Um, in baseball, uh, they're, you know, different various rookies they're hunting. And in football, you know, autographed rookies, things people are hunting. Um, and they're hunting because people are buying, paying top dollar for cards. Uh, so it became a mission uh, in order to track down cards, but not a mission of mine. I mean, I certainly want to track down cards as well. My wife made it her personal mission to hunt down cards. She went to several stores in an attempt to find cards. Now, I'm unfamiliar with this and, you know, been looking into getting, you know, he's certainly been getting into it more often. So we're definitely, this may be something that will be a regular series of videos, um, that we're going to do, but we're going to, um, we actually did acquire some cards here, uh, and we're going to start with, um, baseball here, um, cause there's quite a bit of baseball cards and I'm calling all card collectors. You know, if you watch this video, let me know what it is that I, if I pulled something, um, you know, maybe I'm not familiar with it. Maybe you're more familiar with it. Um, I want people to, what is happening outside? <laughs> I want people to, a uh, major catastrophic event is going on uh, outside. Um, but I want people that are familiar with baseball cards, especially. I know a little bit about football, but I can't say necessarily what's a good card. And that's why we're going to start doing this regularly. There's certain players and certain cards that I know, but there's also certain players and, and cards that I just certainly not going to know. And feel free to call me out in the comments and say, I can't believe you don't know this player. Look, as far as baseball goes, we're from Pittsburgh and we have the Pirates. So, Needless to say, we don't know a ton about baseball outside as far as um, we've been disappointed for so long that baseball is a giant disappointment in this town, but largely ignored just because, ooh. One, one out. Lights are flashing. Something's going on out there. Um, but yeah, baseball is largely ignored. And so... Uh, I feel like I would know some players in these packs, but we are going to crack these packs open. We're going to see if we get cards that we like. What is going on? Really? Really? We're doing this? We're doing this right now? Our lights are flashing in our house for some reason. It's been storming out here for hours. I figured it'd be a good day to rip packs. Not a good day for the lights to go out when I'm in the middle of a video. But anywho, we have... This uh, repack box um, from, I believe it was Rite Aid uh, that we got this. Uh, so it's 100, uh, it's 100 baseball cards and one pack. One in four contains a hit. And what a hit is, if you're unfamiliar, is it's, it would be something like a um, patch card where the card contains a patch of like game used jersey or maybe an autographed card, um, you know, certain numbered, numbered cards. Uh, we also got a pack here of uh, Topps Archive Baseball. Not familiar with this pack, so I don't know exactly what um, what I don't exactly know what is in these um, what what's in these packs or, or what to look for. And also we got a 2019 Topps Baseball Series One and a 2020 Topps Baseball Series One. Um, it says on both of these, look for relic and, or relic and autograph relic cards. Um, so looking forward to seeing what is in these packs, but without further ado, 
let's crack these bad boys open and see uh, see what we got here and if you know a lot more about baseball please feel free to let me know in the comments if i got a good card a bad card a terrible packs if it's packs i shouldn't buy i need your input on this one because i am relatively clueless as far as what cards are good and what cards are bad so let's go check it out okay we're gonna start here with the tops archives baseball um not seeing a lot of these packs get ripped uh so i don't know if there's anything good in here it says more value as compared to the single packs all right okay um, so yeah, baseball cards are going to be tough because I don't really know anyone. Like Trent Grisham, don't know. Marco Gonzalez, Kettle Marte, Eric Hosmer, I've heard of him. Got Hunter Dozier. And also, I'm going to butcher at least a few of these people's names, so just be prepared for that. John Lester, I'm familiar with. Ooh, so this guy, that's a good card actually. That's probably the best card we've pulled out here. This Ronald Acuna Jr. This dude, I you know, is like a phenom at the moment as far as you know from what I've seen. Uh, so that we're gonna put that as like one of the good cards here because I believe that's a good card. Tell me if I'm wrong. Uh, Cole Calhoun, Carter, Kaiboom, Anthony Ray, Anthony Rendon. Oh, a Chipper Jones. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> okay, Chipper Jones. I don't know if that's a good card or not, um, but I do like this next one here. There's a Mike Trout and Otani Angels Elite card. Um, I like that one. That's, that could be a good one. I'm gonna I'm gonna look into that. I wish I knew more about baseball, um, so you could tell me whether or not these are good cards or not. Altuve is a good player. We'll put him here. Ahmed Rosario. Pujols. Pujols is a good player, and we'll put Ahmed Rosario over here. Pujols is good. Ooh, it's like a retro card. Monty Irvin. And then look at this last one. How about a little primetime action? How about a little Deion Sanders? That's awesome. Wow. That's a really cool card. That's amazing. I didn't realize. You know, I'm putting, I'm putting Prime up here. We're going to put Prime up here for that, for fun. Just because I didn't expect to pull Prime out of that pack. Okay, so, so far, you know, first pack in. I, I like that pack. I thought that was pretty cool. Whether those cards are worth anything or not, who's to say? Um, but but I did uh, I did not mind that uh, that pack. So I think we're going to dive into the Topps Baseball 2019 Series One. Look for relic and autograph relic cards because that is what we are looking for. Okay, so. All right. Okay, rookie card on top, I see. All right. Oh, I used to be so much better at ripping packs. Maybe it's just because I didn't think I'd pull anything of value in them. Is that the idea of that? Maybe? Probably? Okay. All right. Don't see anything chunky as far as cards there, but that doesn't mean there isn't anything in there. Okay, Cedric Mullins rookie card, Ryan O'Hearn rookie card, and Tops. You used to be able to see. Oh, it was like a Tops award there. Tanner Rourke, Trey Mancini, Nick Markakis. So far, I've actually heard of a lot of these people. Paul Goldschmidt. Anderlon or Simon Anderlon Simmons? I'm not familiar with him. James McCann. Yonder Alonzo. Justice Sheffield. That's a cool card. A National Stadium card. I wouldn't consider that a hit or anything, but Perez and Rizzo share laughs. Cracking jokes. Is that that's a different cracking jokes card. That's cool. Javier Baez. 
Zach Godley, Irvin Santana, Jackie Bradley Jr., Brandon Lowe. Oh, there's a cool classic card. We got an Ozzy Smith. That's pretty cool. Like a throwback card. Wizard of Oz. I like Ozzy Smith. There, we'll put that one there. Even though it's probably not a hit. It's probably like a base card, but we'll put that there anyway. And then what's this? I mean... <laughs> oh, if only... I like that it's a picture of a signed card. To tease you. Because uh, that signed card uh, <laughs> uh, would be Mike Trout, Albert Pujols, and Otani, <laughs> which would be uh, amazing. Um, but I've never seen a picture of a signed card. That's a, it's a card of a signed card. Okay. All right. Thanks for the tease there. I appreciate it. J.D. Martinez World Series Highlights card. Nolan Arondo League Leaders. That's cool. Jesus Aguilar. Hector Ron Rondon. Yana Cespedes. Austin Hedges. Hunter Strickland. Let's flip these around. Mitch Hanninger. Aaron Hicks. Brandon Nimmo. Paul DeJong. Josh Hader. David Boti, Derek Dietrich, and Davis Wade. So no, um, no sign cards here. They couldn't give me the Trout Pull Holes Otani triple sign card. They had to give me an image of that. Uh, so, oh well, that's fine. And we'll get into the um, the tops twenty twenty baseball series one. Um, once again, relic, autograph relic cards in here. And this one, maybe it's a good sign that this one's tough to get into. Good lord. Alright, so. Do not see any chunky cards in here. Oh, look at that one, amazing. It's a security tag. Um. We got Brad Hand, oh, Pittsburgh Pirate in here. Is Dario Ag Agrizol, not familiar with him. Uh, Rachel Iglesias, Jordan Zimmerman, Abraham Toro, Albert Aldoberto Mondesi. Jose Urena, Randy L. Sorry, I'm, I'm not familiar with him. Uh, Robbie Grossman, Jalen Davis, Jameson Tyon. That's a cool card. Cool Pittsburgh Pirates. Let me toss him up there. Drew Miller. Ooh. Home Run Challenge, John Carlos Stanton. That's cool. We'll toss that one up there for fun. Uh, let's say decades best 1950s Phil Rizzuto. It's not fair. Rizzuto was a, was a baseball player, like Billy Madison said. Uh, Hater Milwaukee, Josh Hater. Uh, Ursh Ursula Geo Ursula, Ryan Braun, Hanser Alberto. Michael Conforto, Anthony Rizzo, familiar with, Nick Pinvinda, uh, his names are getting harder, Randall Grichuk, Carson Kelly, Christian Yellick, Paul Goldschmidt, Trevor Bauer, CJ Cron, Aaron Nola, Willie Ames, Cubs team card, Michael Baez, Robert Osuna, Josh Roses, and Tommy Lastella. Okay, 
So nothing much in those packs. Uh, as far as I'm... Tell me if I'm wrong, if there's something in there uh, that's interesting of note. And we're going into the... Any cards you like so far? Mm, I like the... The fake three autographs. <laughs> he likes the fake three autographs. That's what... That's the one he likes. He likes the fake three autograph. He, he would Dion. He would like it if it was real. What one? The Deion Sanders. Oh, the Deion Sanders. Okay, the prime time. See, baseball is not really our sport. Um, I blame the Pirates for this, um, for sure. And they have jinxed this town um, with their losing ways in many Trading years. Keep, yeah, they get someone good, trade them away. Okay, so these cards... You know, it's kind of a repack, so all types of mix of different card companies and stuff. So we're going to dig in here, see a few that are in here. You got a Mike Miner, Rick Roden. See some of these are from different years. Tim Jones and Alex Sanchez. Leave the pack to the side. That is a... Donruss Baseball Puzzle and Cards Pack. It is from what year? Ne is it 1990? I think it's 1990. Or maybe even earlier. I don't know. You let me know. Right in the mix of the junk wax era. So we got Brad Boxberger. Uh, Richard Urena. These cards are like all over the place here. Michael LaRosen. Alan Hansen. I remember when he was supposed to be one of the Pirates' top guys in their thing here. Jim Sunberg. Melito Mil Perez. Cal Daniels. Denny Martinez. Ray Burris, Gary Getty, Rich Hebner, Rob Dibble, Mike Maddox, Pascal Perez, Ruben Sierra, Right Aid Team MVPs, Tops card. <laughs> wow. Eddie Whitson. Oh, that's a little card. Is that Dwight Gooden? That's cool. It's like a little mini card. Molly Joyner. That's an old card. Dan Spilner. Rated rookie. Julio Macha Machado. Paul Sorrento. Glenn Beckert. Keith Moreland. They're all over the place. Mark Portugal. Oh, Spanky Lavalier. Mike Lavalier. <laughs> Dennis Cook. Danny Tartable. Kevin Mitchell. Steve Finley. Mike Morgan. Oh, cool. Diamond Kings, Chris Brown. Never heard of that guy, but I've always liked the Diamond Kings cards. I used to have a bunch of them. Uh, we got Joe Price, Bob Walk, that is an announcer for the Pirates currently, Dave Collins, Sean Dunstan, Kevin Moss, Victor Cole. These cards are all over the place. Don Baylor, Lee Smith. Jay Tibbs, Tony Phillips. That's a cool card. Alex Diaz, rookie prospect. 2005, Jason Mott. Giovanni Soto, world champions, tops. Get Joe Cauley, Matt Drews. Oswald Pereza, Don Baylor, Alex Fernandez, Daniel Robinson. So not much so far, at least based on what I've seen. And tell me if I'm wrong. What? Tim Salmon. I always liked that guy growing up. I always had him in my teams and stuff. Barry Jones, Henry Rodriguez, Doug, Doug Drabeck. Randy Reddy, you got a Jack Clark, a Dave Clark, Darren Lewis, Mike Lacoste, 
Rob Deere, Dave Hansen, Ivan Cald Calderon, Dave Nilsson, Brent Gates, Joe Vitro, Cal Ripken Jr. Man of the Year, score 92. Put that one, we'll pop that one up there too, for fun. Just because, okay. Uh, Roberto Kelly, Rick Lysander. Oh, this is a cool card. Oh, there's a patch card. There you go. Wow. So my only patch card comes out of a <laughs> comes out of a repack box. Um, but that's cool. It's game worn jersey. Livon Hernandez. I'm actually familiar with him. It's game worn jersey baseball series polar bear patch card. That's really cool. All right, cool. We'll put that up there. Nice shiny card. Um, and that will probably be the only hit from this pack, but we'll, we'll look. Maybe there's more. We could be wrong. Um, Pedro Guerrero. Jason Bay. <laughs> Jason Bay. My favorite thing about Jason Bay is the Pirates traded Brian Giles, um, and the GM said, well, we're trading Gi Brian Giles for the guy who's going to be the next Brian Giles. Not somebody better than Brian Giles. They wanted somebody, somebody as good as Brian Giles, and that was Jason Bay, um, who actually did had a few good seasons here. But Dave Con Conception, <laughs> Conception, <laughs> Dave Parker. You got a Johnny Ray, Bob something, Walt Weiss, uh, Keith Kimsey. You got a Kmart Dream Team, Ron Gant. Darren Holmes, Steve Wilson. Oh, these cards are from all types of different years. Uh, Louis Leal, Chet Lemon, Danny Nagel. Two Chet Lemons. A Terry Taylor and Vance Lovelace Prospects card. Jeff Reed, not to be confused with the Steelers kicker. Trevor Pluff. Yeah, Alejandro Pena, Esteban Beltre. Oh, that's cool. A Dave Justice National League Rookie of the Year. That would be a get. Um, so we'll toss him on the side. I don't know. Cards are falling. Andy Bennis, John Franco, Todd Frowith, Terry Bros, Kent Herbeck, and Chad Billingsley. Okay, so. One last pack to go. It was the pack that was in here. And I think it's Donrust 90. So we're going to pop this open. And we're going to see. I don't know. My, card, my hits are falling all over the place. I don't even sure if they're hits. Tell me if they're hits. I mean, they're not hits hits. They're not like, you know, just other than that one patch we pulled. They're not like major hits. But. All right. This card. This card pack is from a long time ago. Okay, so that, yeah, it's Donruss 90. And this is a puzzle piece of some kind. Wow, 1990 card pack we're opening up here. You got a Dave Parker, Willie McGee, Tracy Jones, Benito Santiago, John Farrell, Greg Gagne, MVP Greg Swindle, Clint something... Jose Gonzalez, Milt Thompson, Dave Steeb, Sid Bream. Oh no, that's memories of him limping around third base playing for the Braves, killing off the last, the Pirates' last chance at a World Series. Tim Burke, a checklist card, Eric Davis MVP card, and a Ken Griffey Sr. to round them out. That's very cool. That's Ken Griffey's dad, in case you were wondering. All right, so let's check the um, the hits real quick. At least what, what I determined are hits. And we'll, you know, we'll put Dwight Gooden in there for fun. And you can determine whether they're hits or hits to you or hits to me. Someone who is for, far more knowledgeable on cards. I'm not saying these are good cards. I'm not saying they're worth anything. I'm just saying 
that I know who these people are, and therefore that should count. Okay, so Dwight Gooden, little mini card. You got a Phil Rizzuto. Usually these ones of like older players don't really amount to much. Uh, reprint Wizard of Oz. Uh, I do like the Ozzy Smith card. I like the Deion Sanders um, Reds card. The Trout and Otani one, that's probably good, I'd say. The Acuna pulled out of the first pack. Jameson Tyon, just for the Pirates alone. Cal Ripken, Junior, Giancarlo Stanton, and Chipper Jones. So let me know, how did we do? You feel like um, those packs were worth it? I would say they would be about probably like $5 a pack. Maybe one of the, the Topps archives was a little bit less. Um, but good, bad, indifferent. Leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts below. Let me know if you like um, card pack opening videos, if you want to see more of them. Because um, we are doing a couple. My son has decided he's going to be into cards. So we've been scouring around looking for cards everywhere, but it's a tough find. So we may be opening more. Oh, wait, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot the, uh, you know, I'm showing off the hits and there's a David Justice rookie. And of course the one patch card, which was Levon Hernandez, Polar Bear, shiny, cool patch card. Um, but yeah, leave a comment down below. Let me know your thoughts. Uh, let me know how we did on this on these packs. Are they good packs? Are they bad packs? Baseball is not really my sport, to be honest. Um, I am more of a football, basketball, hockey type person. I blame the Pirates for this. But let me know uh, if you want to support um, me on Patreon. There's a link in the description below. If you would like to buy a t-shirt, there's a link to the in the description below for that. And we will see you uh, very soon here with another video. But until then, bye, everyone. Bye.